Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you'd like to see how I created this inner demon makeup look, then please continue watching. I began by outlining the demon face with a white eyeliner pencil. And then went ahead and covered the eyebrow on the demon side of the face and I did this using Alma's glue. Once I've covered all the hairs, I brush them upwards and flatten them with a steel spatula. I use this mini fan to help speed up the drying process. This is actually a cyclist neck fan which I got off Amazon and is really useful when you're doing your makeup. It prevents you from getting a bit sweaty in the summer months and it also helps in speeding up the drying process. Once the glue was set, I used some 70% isopropyl alcohol just to remove any residue glue that may be on the skin. I set the brow with Laura Mercier translucent setting powder. I then went ahead and concealed the eyebrow with this Laura Mercier High Coverage Concealer in shade 1. This is such a great concealer, it's so opaque and blends so well with the skin, but unfortunately this has been discontinued. I set the eyebrow one more time with some more translucent powder. I then drew the outline for where I was going to place all the horns. I then used this third degree which is a silicone modeling compound. I mixed equal parts from both A and B. Just make sure not to use the same tool to dip into both parts because it will cause the product to cure and you will ruin it. Once this is cured, this will be used as a pocket for the horns to give the effect of them breaking out of the skin. I painted myself white using the Makeup Forever Color Airbrush and I did this using an artist brush from my local craft store. To paint the demon side of my face, I used the Mayron Paradise Tropical Palette in Beachberry. Once the silicone had dried, I cut an X into it using scissors which will serve as the flaps of skin. I 
I used spirit gum on the base of the horns, lifted up the flaps of silicone and stuck them onto my skin. I then outlined the demon face with the black from the Makeup Forever flash colour case. I then blended in the outline to create some shading. As the airbrush colour doesn't sit well on the eyelids, I decided to go over them with the Danessa Myricks colour fix in Lift and Bloom. I highlighted the white side of the eye with a grey colour from the Mayron Cream Blend palette. and highlighted the demon side of the eye with the black from the Huda Beauty Smoky Obsessions palette. I also used this to highlight the cheekbones and underneath the horns to create some depth. I used the white from the Makeup Forever Flash Colour Case to add in small details. And I use the Mayron coagulated blood around all the horns to add to the illusion of them breaking out of the skin.
I inserted the sclera lenses and wig off camera. I applied lashes from MAC Cosmetics. I painted the other lashes white using the Danessa Myricks Color Fix in the color Lift. And finally I applied the Mayron Squirt Blood around the mouth area. <laughs> and that's the completed look guys thanks for watching if you liked this video and found it helpful please give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing